Emma Rodokanu, who has been under fire over the last couple of days by former players, uh, including Daniela Hantrakova, who came out uh, saying that Rodokanu is losing the respect of other players. Let's start with the, uh, some of the comments that Hantrakova had to say about Rodokanu. So this is what she said. That was a tough one for Emma. I think it's going to hurt big time because of the chances she had. Uh, she was the better player for most of it. But the thing is now with Emma, everyone wants to beat her. Everyone is trying to figure out how to play against her. But all the locker room respect she had after the US Open is now kind of going away which is a shame. It is going to be important now for Emma to regroup, rethink what she has to change and get out there on the practice court. At that age, you want to be fit. Uh, you want to show everyone that you are out there no matter how long it takes. Uh, it is. It was humid and it wasn't easy out there. But this is where you have to be tough. And if you want to win matches like this, uh, if you want to win tournaments like this, and I believe Emma has the level. She just has to find a way to, to get it out of her. So those were the comments from Hanjakova in uh, after the match uh, on Amazon Prime, I'm assuming. It doesn't seem like she's overly critical, but again, maybe the choice of words, saying that losing respect and all that kind of stuff. Uh, Rodi kind of actually came out and uh, defended herself against those comments because, you know, and I think people are going to put one and, you know, two and two together and be like, okay, well, you know, yeah, she's she has all these sponsorships and she's, too busy driving Porsches and, uh, you know, taking uh, at photo shoots and premieres. Uh, she's not on the practice court. She's not even practicing anymore. She's just too busy doing other stuff. And that's not true. She just doesn't publicize that she's in the gym every day. You know, she doesn't, you know, she puts the, the sponsorships on because it's probably part of her sponsorship deal that she has to promote the products, right? On her social media. 